If you want to skip the future, what you have to go do is press this button on your keyboard. And it's usually located on the top left right here as an example. And here's another keyboard again on the top left. And interestingly enough, they're called the tilde key as well as the grave accent. So let's very quickly create a new character. Press the space bar to skip. Space bar to skip again. And again. And then after that, press the tilde slash grave accent on your keyboard. And you should get this message. Are you sure you want to skip the tutorial? Press OK. And then after that, usually you would get a pop-up message if it's your first time. Now, since it's not my first time, uh, it's not appearing, but I should uh, show you a message relating to it through video editing. Now, if you're probably wondering how come it's really dark outside, the main reason why is because I'm currently recording this uh, during October of 2019 while the Halloween event is going on. So for people watching this in the distant future, you know the reason why. So anyways, you just go from your start point, you go on this bridge uh, and go to number two and you go to this dex bot that says time lab. You press warp. And then you just go directly to the time machine. Press warp to past, warp to the past again. And out of these four, um, ben, Tennyson, and Dexter are pretty much the most popular. Ed is number three, and Mojo Jojo is number four. The reference from this comes from the Fusion Fall Wiki. I'll just choose Ben Tennyson. And then you should be able to go get your nanos. For number two, I would recommend Fast Feet Run Self. Definitely very useful for infected zone running. For Eddie, I would recommend Jawbreaker Break. Definitely very useful while leveling up because he provides you a lot of health when you're in, when you're in pain. And the final one would have to be Drain Area or Monster Roar, which is going to be very helpful once you are in the post game and you're going to go uh, kill a lot of monsters to obtain items. Now, if you're interested in uh, knowing what kind of powers your nanos should have, Inside of the description as well as on the comments, I have a guide that I wrote down which should help you out. And yeah, that's pretty much it. If you go inside of your journal, um, interestingly enough, it doesn't really show anything that you completed outside of the mandatory tutorial mission as well as the mandatory nano mission. So this is very helpful. If you found this Again, helpful. Please leave a like, please comment, please subscribe, check out the Discord server and the Universal Item Guide. On The link is inside of the, the description. And yeah, thank you for watching, and I'll see you again next time. Bye.